the effect of pressure on the equilibrium between dinitrogen tetroxide and nitrogen dioxide can be followed by compressing a mixture in a gas syringe. An electric drill and a threaded rod allows the mixture to be compressed with a fair degree of control. Dry nitrogen dioxide was prepared for this demonstration by heating solid lead nitrate and collecting the gas formed in a cold trap at minus 60 degrees Celsius. Oxygen produced in the decomposition was allowed to escape to the atmosphere. The cold trap was evacuated with a vacuum pump leaving solid colourless dinitrogen tetroxide. The compound was then allowed to evaporate at atmospheric pressure into the glass syringe, which was sealed with a tap. When the mixture is compressed, it initially darkens, but as a new position of equilibrium between gaseous dinitrogen tetroxide and nitrogen dioxide is established, the colour lightens significantly as a greater concentration of dinitrogen tetroxide is produced. This effectively lowers the pressure in the syringe. It is also interesting to note that the new equilibrium position is not achieved instantaneously but takes a little time to become re-established.